Welcome to your Osan 2-Minute Report. I'm Air Force Sergeant Mike Tadaishi. With the 101 critical days of summer in full swing, military installations across the globe are taking preventative measures. Air Force Sergeant Joshua Pergen reports that one installation in Korea is breaking new ground in vehicle safety. To help combat vehicle incidents and improve overall vehicle safety, USAG Humphreys opened up the first overseas motorcycle simulator. As soon as garrison leadership cut the ribbon, military members were already racking up miles of safety. The simulator teaches the rider how to adjust to various weather conditions and surroundings. This is a perfect complement to the driving simulators that are already in place and teaching drivers how to respect the rules of the road. I'm from New York, so I'm used to a lot of traffic and stuff. And I haven't driven in two years, so this is good practice for when I go back in two months. The simulators help military members who are beginners to advance brush up on their driving skills. While the simulators promote safety, occasionally bad habits still tend to sneak up on the operators. Although the simulators will aid in training safer drivers, USAG Humphreys has been leading the way in regards to safety for quite some time. Uh, actually, we have been accident-free in POVs, NTVs, Army tactical vehicles, and motorcycles in the last two years. With the addition of the simulators, USAG Humphreys hopes to continue to be accident-free for many more years to come. I'm Air Force Sergeant Joshua Perigen, USAG Humphreys, Korea.